Alrighty, folks. Welcome on back to Stellaris. Uh, in all honesty, I completely forgot what we were going to be doing today. Uh, I do know that our plan is to start invading these guys. Uh, but honestly, I don't remember from what direction we were going to do that. Especially since up here is so weird. Uh, anyway, we are integrating the Zakpot Galactic League uh, in order to get that taken care of. Get this guy taken care of and get them to stop claiming our territory. <laughs> However, I noticed when I logged in that we were under our naval capacity. So, I was looking through here and there's some that still need to be upgraded with something. And I believe most of these are... Oops. The defense grade supercomputers that we're missing. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be a lot of defense grade supercomputers. So let's get those in real quick. Um, we have 6,000. How much are these apiece? 225? Oh, pshaw. Okay, so we've got resource silo, um, deep space black site, I believe. And an upgrade. How about you? You need an upgrade, but we're lacking the minerals. Great. Okay, let's take off the upgrade. Um, I'm going to have to come back through here at some point. But right now what I want to check on is the anchorages. Defense grid supercomputer. You're good. You're good. You're good. Here we go. This is where stuff starts having fun. Anchorages. Instead of the crew quarters, you get the naval logistics. And then here you get a resource silo. And then an upgrade for 2,000. Yeah, that's fine. Same here. Anchorages. Oh, you're good. So you just get the resource silo and an upgrade. You just get anchorages and a resource silo. Same here because we don't have the money to do it. We will soon, but not currently. All right, so that should take care of our fleet issues. Um... Some of our factions are causing Debris issues, but they're analyzed. not too bad. All right. What was analyzed from the debris? We got advanced strike craft and advanced afterburners. Was that you that was analyzing this? Looks like the answer to that question was yes. Okay. Is there anything anywhere that you need to do? Nope. We have an orbital research mandate. Okay. Okay. Uh, I believe you were from Gamma Draconis. Indeed you were. So let's get you back here to assist in research. Oops. <laughs> Wrong buttons. Let's push all the things and have none of it be correct. Um, I do believe... What are we doing down here? Why are you guys... Why are you not 40? You're at 33. Um, you're going somewhere. Well, I guess I can unpause while I try to figure all this out. Are we still... Okay, we are still building here and here. So that's two. We already have one that's set up, so that's two. So you should be going to join up. Who are you going... Oh, whatever. We'll figure it out here in a bit. Complete. Once they all join up and things stop building, that's when we'll figure it out. Our ships have been made superior. All right, awesome. Ship upgrades are done. Those are very useful and very needed. Our ships um, have been made superior. Well, you're an anchorage station. Okay, that's fine. Especially since we're making 974 energy credits per turn. I could probably turn some of these... Uh, uh, some of these... No, not those. Um, some like these. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Alright, so we got flat cannons, which is good. It means we have to upgrade again, but that's okay. Uh, I could go with flak artillery. We could go with advanced strike craft. Let's actually go with advanced strike craft. That's going to take eight months. Um, so I'm going to hold off on upgrading... 
We're making 947 energy. Just wow. That's all I have to say is wow. All right, so none of the bastions, which you're going to be a bastion. Uh, let's throw your last upgrade in here as well. So, what I think we're going to do here is switch all you guys out for anchorages. At least on a couple more of these. Give us some slightly more fleets. Uh, so that was Soul. Let's do Sirius as well. Because you should not be calling people Shirley. <laughs> Shirley, you can't be serious. I am, and don't call me Shirley. <laughs> oh, it's it has been the too conquest long. Of a new world has begun. Too long since I have seen airplane. And that's what that's from. That is from Airplane. That is probably one of my favorite movies. Um But it 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 varies. Sometimes it's one of my favorite movies and a little bit later, it's not one of my favorite movies. It all depends on how I'm feeling that day. So, you know. Okay. Um, let's see here. Migration treaty, I don't care about. Trade deal duration expired. That's fine. They'll ask us for that here again in a minute. Gateway construction site ready. Except we don't have the mineral credits for it. We need 12,000. Okay, I'm going to leave you here just to remember where that is. Uh, I should probably get one built up here as well. So, can I bring you... Let's bring you here. Uh, can I get you to build a mega a, a gateway construction? Oh, I do have to actually zoom in. Cannot build outside Emperor Borders. Dang. Okay. We could put one here in the maw. That's going to eat up a pretty chunk of uh, influence, however. <laughs> that... Oh, it actually eat up a lot of it. Scientific breakthrough achieved. All right, so there's our strike craft. We could get advanced afterburners as well. However, I don't think many are using afterburners. We could get the kinetic artillery. I guess the kinetic artillery is it. Okay, so now in here, let's pause it. Maybe one day. Uh, I got you guys reworked. So instead of the amoeba flagella, which do 33.6, 100% shield, 50% armor damage, they're, they're the same. This one just does just a little tiny bit more damage. All right, so let's get that upgraded. That was our cruiser, right? So now I was going to say we should have a hangar battle or a hangar battleship in here somewhere. Let's get that saved. Make sure the cruiser saved. Uh, apparently, I have two. Oops. Nope. We want advanced strike craft. Not the flagella. Our Titan does not have any. Defense platform doesn't. Ion cannon is just the ion cannon, and the Colossus is the Colossus. Okay. Cool. So now we can upgrade you guys. I wish there was an upgrade key, if that's okay. Everything upgraded. You're at 96 because you don't have a... Um, what do you call it? The big bad uh, Titans. Our ships have been made superior. That's what I was looking superior. for. Titan. Alright, so we got upgraded again. <laughs> so, we were just under... <laughs> we now have an extra 100 capacity. 20, 40, 60, 80. I could. I could put all of these fleets at max. Let's do it. Uh, let's edit this. Okay, let's see here. 12. I need to add 2, 1, 
two. Puts us at six here. Putting us at 112 with the Titan. Uh, let's add one, two, one, two, one, two. All right. So that's 14, 14, 14, and six. Oops. There we go. One. And here, 14, 14, 14, six. However, this can now go up to seven. And I can still, I think, bump this up again to eight. There we go. And then the Dreadnought Armada. Ooh. What? <laughs> uh, what's in your armada, dude? Because apparently it's broken. <laughs> Can I seriously not modify your armada? That's interesting. Okay, so what do you have? You know what? I know what I can do. Here. Here. We already have destroyers, so let's add both corvettes. The destroyer, cruiser, battleship, battleship, battleship. Alright, so that's one of each battleship. That's going to be six cruisers. Transmission. 12, 12, and 12, and we'll see where we're at. 12. Okay. Incoming transmission. There we go. That is weird. Okay, now it's showing that we have enough. Um, we also need a little bit more to reinforce all. Let's see here. Trade deal. Minerals for food. I give you food? Okay. <laughs> Minerals for food. Okay. I'll do it twice. Sure, why not? <laughs> And then the Zackpot Galactic League, which we're integrating because they're being annoying, um, have laid claim to another system. So now if I come in here and look at your fleet manager, you're, you're, you're all right. Okay. So we need 23,000 to reinforce everybody with all 59 ships. That'll put us at 600 out of 656. I could make another fleet. That's a little bit ridiculous. I could make another fleet. It'd only be like a 50 fleet, but I could make another fleet. The conquest of a new world has begun. All right, let's check on our star bases, specifically Seoul. You're still getting switched over. However, now I can switch this over to the Naval Logistics. Uh, same, he nope, not same there. Uh, same with Sirius. I'll get to you in just, both of you in just a second. Naval Logistics, okay. Yes, we would like to extend our deal, and yes, we would like to extend our deal. All right, we're going to take Ur Urner. We're the going to do the... Of a new world has begun. Oh, hey, look, we won. We won the game by owning 40% of habitable planets. Um, wow. Okay, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that for a while yet. <sighs> this, this. <laughs> what am I supposed to put in this slot now? <laughs> okay, so. I could do a modded game, that is true, and I can't wait, so I have to make this decision today because I have two more of this time slot episodes to record today. Um, I could do a modded playthrough, however, as soon as anything updates and breaks, it kind of invalidates everything uh, because of how Steam works. We could do another, I don't really want another vanilla playthrough. Um, so let's do modded. Let me get my, my mod playlist essentially up and running. 
uh, make sure everything's updated and working, and we'll do that. Anyway, we, as Drizzle's Horizon, owned 47 planets. 47. Uh, we had 602 population. We had 1,777 military fleets. Is that 1,777 fleet power? No. That's like nothing. Research. We out-researched any two combined um, pops. And I didn't even mean to go the we take um, what do you call it? These guys. Uh, vassals. I didn't mean to do vassals. It just kind of happened. So, we are going to end off today's episode here. Uh, I am going to fiddle with the mods. I'm going to get it updated. I'm going to do all that stuff. And then we will be back two days for... No, sorry. Day after tomorrow uh, with a brand new Stellaris. It'll be modded. It's not going to be, like, super modded, but it's going to be different. We're going to have extra ship types. We're going to have um, an actual hull type. We're going to have a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, one of the big... One of the big mods that I'm waiting on is the uh, Star Wars mod that's similar to Star Trek Horizons. When that comes out, we will definitely be doing a playthrough on that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I know it's a little bit, it's a whole lot shorter than I meant it to be, but it is what it is. Uh, so yeah, if you guys liked this, hit that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing and checking out some of my other content. And as always, I will catch you folks in the next episode. Stay frosty out there.